Barbara. And I'm Karen, and we're the Sync Sisters. This is our tech bit on the Photos app, Albums and Organizing. All right, so today we're going to show you how to organize your photos into albums so that you can better be organized. Right. We've taken a lot of pictures on our devices, so we want to we want to organize them up. So the, for two different ways, well, why would you want to do an album, first of all? I mean... Albums are a way to put things together so that you can sort them by different things that you've done. Maybe um, you're on vacation or maybe you've, you've taken a ton of pictures. You just want to put your best pictures into an album so that right. you can share them with somebody. It's an easy way to access it. Easy way to out. access you know, it. You look through your photos and <clears throat> Right, find them. right. And it's never fun to show somebody all the pictures you took. You want no. to take your best ones, put them in an album, mm -hmm. um, then you can do different things with them. So we're going to go ahead and show you two different ways to do it. Now, we're right. in the albums view on the iPad. Yep. And we're going to show you the iPhones a little bit different. We're going to show you that in a second. Here is the albums down on the bottom. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the top, and I'm going to hit the plus. And it's going to say, enter a new name for the album. I'm just going to call it Horses. Because you love your horses. <clears> and I you do. want their best photos available be at your fingertips. That's right. That's <laughs> right. So I'm going to save it. And then it's going to say, okay, let's add some photos to this album called Horses. And I could do different things. I could select all. I can select um, because I'm here. First of all, I have two different views that I can right. select from. The photos view. Or the albums view. Or the view. albums view. Which would include your all photos. Right. So in the photos view, right now, I'm in, you know, by collection. So I could say, oh, I want to take all of these and add them. So I could just select. Or I could select individual pictures mm -hmm. that I want to add. Right. And then I just say done, and it's going to add them in. Done. Boom. Now and if I go to the bottom, it happens to be all the way at the bottom. We're going to show you how to move these around in a minute. There's the horse's album, and there are the pictures that are and in there. they're so cute. They're so cute. <laughs> now I'm going to go back, and I'm going to go and to, go and scroll to the top. Yep, go back to go your back all to photos. all photos. And now I'm going to pick some pictures to put in there. So the first time you made an album and then put the photos in, right. now you're going to select the pictures and create an album. That is correct. So I tapped on select, and now I can go out and I can tap on the photos that I want to put in there. I think that's uh, maybe all of them. And then I just go up here and I say add to. And then it's going to bring up the albums. Now you can't add to the ones that Apple creates. Right. Those the are albums, Apple yeah. created, but here's all the ones that I've Custom created. Custom albums here. Gonna go on. So you could add them to any album, or I could. I'm going down and finding the horses one and adding it to it. Yep. And now they're all in there. That's it. Yes. You could also um, choose to do a new album. Oh, that's right. Yes. You are correct. So, I forgot to show that. So right. I added it to that album. Now let's go out and do six some other things. <laughs> Get some other ones. Let's add the dogs in there. There you Let's go. say I want to create one for the dog. So I've add selected to. my photos, add to, and now I can go all the way to the bottom and I can do a Snatches new video. album. Yep. And now I'm going to call it Dogs and save. Yep. And now I created an album called Dogs. We go back out to the album view. All the way to the bottom. And there it is. Dogs. Now you've got your horses and your dogs, you're set. So, so you can either create the album, put photos in, or you can select the photos and create an album for it. That's right. And once you have an album, you can also take pictures out. What if you decide you don't really like a certain photo or want it in there? So I'm going to open the album. This, this is the dog's album. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to tap select. And I'm going to choose this photo. And I'm going to hit delete. Now. I don't want to delete it. I know. <laughs> it doesn't. It just deleted it. Leads it from the album. Similar to when you create an album and put photos into it, it doesn't move the only copy. It's moving a copy of that photo into the album. Right. The photo is still in your all photos. That's right. So it works the same way here. If I delete it from the album, it's not deleting it from permanently. It's right. just deleting it Taking from the, it album. the album. Yep. Yeah. It yeah. even says this will be removed from this <clears> album, <throat> but will remain in your photo library. More type in gray. Always good to read the type in gray on your device. So I will, I just deleted that. That's great. Now you have a bunch of albums I noticed here, and so right. you probably want a good way to organize and control them. Right. So the way you do that, first I'm going to show you on the iPad, and then I'm going to bring in the iPhone because the phone is quite a bit different, a little bit different. If I, I'm in the albums view, I'm going to tap edit, and you see it brings up these little X's. Now, of course, I could 
tap on that and delete, but you probably wouldn't want me to actually no, delete it. Want you to delete them. Thank you. <laughs> but I could delete them. Mm -hmm. And then also, if I just tap and hold on one, I could organize them. Oh, you can move it around. So if yeah. I really want this one, you know, to be up higher, so it's not so hard to get to see lovely nail polish colors. Right. I could so do it there. Right. Yeah. Yes. yes. <laughs> So, uh, I wanted to bring in the phone quick because it's, oh, there's the TV light. Here I am in the album's view. Again, just on the phone. If I tap edit, it's a little bit different. You'll notice yeah. by each album it puts a little um, red, red circle with a switch on it. And then these three lines. The red circle would be if I wanted to delete it, which I don't. Or, and then, um, well, you could see, I could also just swipe. Right. Well, that well, now work. Yeah. Yeah. Um, these three lines, if I tap and hold, this is how you move it on the phone. Right. Like that. You just grab the three line just icon. It's a little bit different. Yep. Why did they put the red switch here, too? You can keep it the same. I know. Yeah. Here? Yeah. It's just a little black. That's why yeah. I thought we should bring yeah. the phone in because. Why not just put the red switch I know. Around? Make them look the same. That would have been easy. Anyway. So, the um, albums are really a powerful <laughs> uh, way to organize your photos and everything. So. This is how to uh, organize your albums. Thanks for watching the Sync Sisters Tech Bit. And please subscribe to our channel.